Welcome back, it's your guy Engineer Mojo. Today, I'm gonna to show you how to clear up your foggy headlights and also do a product review on the Sylvania Headlight Restoration Kit. To get it started off fast, tools you'll need are Sylvania Headlight Restoration Kit or a brand that you prefer. You also need a bucket of water. I prefer having two, a clean and a dirty side so I can keep them separate. A towel or rag. I personally prefer a microfiber towel for this job but any rag will do. I forgot to mention in the tool list, you also need painter's tape. I'm going through the Sylvania Headlight Kit Restoration package right here. It comes with a full instruction kit, as well as various sandpaper grits to get a smooth finish to your headlight, uh, some gloves, and also various uh, UV and cleaning applications, which I'll show you how to use later on in the video. Little Thumbelina right there. It appeared to be a fairly complete kit at this point. First step is to clean the headlight. I'm using a simple green solution here, but a mild detergent and water would work just as well. And make sure you dry this off completely. Next step is to apply surface activator. This cleans any yellow staining and removes any previously applied clear coat. Apply this pretty heavily, but leave at least half in the bottle because you'll need the extra half for the last step. After about 30 seconds, you're clear to go ahead and rinse this off and wipe the headlight down again to remove all the old grit. The next step will take some arm strength. You're given three levels of sandpaper in the kit, a coarse, a medium, and a fine grit. You wanna wet sand your headlight, starting with the coarse and working your way to fine. The kit recommends about five minutes at each level. Well, it's a lot of work, but uh, the more work you put in this step, the better. Just remember to always keep the sandpaper wet as well as your headlight. After sanding, the next step is to do some polishing. And that's where you take your clarifying compound and you put about a quarter size dollop onto the white cloth that's provided in the kit. And you use this and you rub it into the headlight for about five minutes. Again, this is a arm workout. Again, you wanna do this simultaneously to both headlights. When you're finished with this, you should have a white haze on your headlights, this is normal. After polishing, you want to go back and use the surface activator from earlier in the process and reapply it to your headlights. Keep this on for about 30 seconds, let it get in there. And after about 30 seconds, go ahead and rinse it off and wipe it down and clean it off again. I grabbed a clean microfiber towel for this last step. I wanted to get all moisture and no residual lint on the headlight for this last application of UV clear coat. I'm applying gloves per the instructions of the kit. This is my own nitrite gloves, but the kit does come with gloves. Here's a UV block clear coat to be applied. You wanna apply this pretty heavy onto the provided cloth and onto your headlight. The thicker the coating, the better. You wanna start from the top and work fairly slow on your way down, creating a small overlap as you're working down and this basically applies a hard clear coat to your headlight. As you can see, my headlight is starting to clean up and shine and glisten in the sun with this application of the clear coat. Here's the end result. I'm happy with the look of the headlights. Again, the more sanding effort you put in, the better the end result. So overall, I'm pretty happy with the Sylvania product. Well, that'll do it for this video. As I stated earlier, I did like this kit. It came with all the necessary items I needed to do the restoration besides, you know, the bucket of water and additional rags. But overall, I was pleased with the outcome of the headlights. As always, if you have any tips, please comment down below. If you like the video, please like, please share. And just a reminder, this is a community. I love learning from viewers as much as I'm trying to show. And as always, thanks for watching. I'm out.